Good morning, y'all. How y'all doing? This is kind of my first adventure in Colombia. Anyways, it's a girl, global girl, camera girl who travels the world. Before we start this video, I would love for you to subscribe to this channel, like, and most importantly, share. Share with all your family and friends to tell them about the global girl adventures. Okay, now we're in Colombia. We have landed, we're settling safely and stuff. And today, we are, oh no, let me tell you the story. So, I have a friend of mine who is Lucian, and she introduced me to one of her friends who's Colombian. Hi Nelly, hi Maria, even though I haven't met Maria yet, but I will after this video. And the first day, we got introduced on Friday, I think, and then Maria's like, hey, I'm going paragliding on Sunday, do you want to come? And I was like, whoa okay we're jumping right in and so i was thinking about it but then she told me the price and i've done it before but alaka has never done it so i messaged her like i said hey random but do you want to go paragliding in two days she was like yes and so i was like all right we're in so completely unplanned but this is through a connect um so maria and nelly thank you so much maria is picking us up and then i think we have about an hour or 45 minutes an hour's drive to go to this paragliding place and then we're going to run off a cliff and go zoom in the air it's only for about 15 minutes but it's probably going to be an amazing view and i hope to take some photos i have to show y'all this new flag that i have that i really want to start to show off more it's a caribbean Unity flag, yes. So I'm repping the whole. I'm repping the Caribbean. You check. Um, it's not to my beat up, but the Caribbean in and of itself. So we have to wear comfortable clothes. So I'm in my standard workout stuff. I have my jacket here in case it's cold up in the air, and I have to put on my sneakers. So or tennis shoes. I don't know what y'all call it. But yeah, so I'm gonna go get ready because we have to go meet Maria a block or two down the road. So let's see how it goes. And the great thing is I'm gonna be able to record everything because they give you a camera to hold and you can just see so y'all are gonna see. Okay, enough talking. Bye. This is awkward putting on socks and shoes with one hand. Okay, gotta pack my bag and then good to go. We got the good week. Flags. Wallet. Snap. Keys. Sunglasses. Um water bottle. I think we're good. Camp. Walking down these Colombian streets.
Maybe we don't need it. I, I don't know. Maybe I have a bag if you want to stick it in at some point. Hi, everyone. Um, we've made it to up the mountain. My ears are popping and everything, and the view is amazing. And we're here with two great people. Okay. Monica yeah, okay, okay. and Lucas. Just met them, but they're awesome already. And we're gonna use the bathroom. Tango Chichi. <laughs> I just learned how to say that, and that's gonna be my favorite phrase. Cause it's I need to pee. So y'all, I can see plenty of the paragliding companies are over here. Ours is up there, but this is clearly a spot for paragliding. And as you will see, the view is beautiful. We're going up. Five minutes later. And it just keeps going. Yeah. <laughs> we barely got up any stairs. But look what's left. Oh, bonjour. And they just casually have a conversation. This is like, oh, yeah. Oh, yes. So bad. Just what happened? I don't do nothing all day. <laughs> Active. Just sit up on your computer. these clouds rolled in you could see Medellin but they were all here clouds it's just rolling he just like shoot, disappeared into the clouds and it's literally I could see them no. so the weather has definitely cleared up and they said that it's our turn so next time I'm talking to y'all, I'll probably be strapped up. Everything actually happens very quickly once you're called up. There are so many moving pieces. Once I was strapped up, I barely got to say bye to my friends before I was called over to go run off the mountain. No time to think or be worried. It's just go, go, go.
y'all the experience was amazing we were literally gliding through the clouds and even though it was cold i got to see the countryside of medellin which was absolutely beautiful and green my instructor was really nice too turns out he's been doing this for 15 years and flies almost every single day everyone we're all back we're all back yo it was it was beautiful it was amazing at first it's kind of like whoa what's happening because you're just kind of thrown into it but then after that you're like oh this is pretty and you're literally among the clouds literally and you just have to get over the fact that you ran off a hill but yes how was it Aleka? it was incredible honestly once in a lifetime experience I would do it again though. <laughs> Definitely. And then you get the picture straight to your phone. Yeah. Like what they're doing here. I have too much. I don't have enough space. Oh no. How was your experience? Uh, yeah, nice. It's an overwhelming feeling like being being in the clouds, passing the clouds, yeah. going through the clouds. It was like, cold too. Happy you brought your jacket? Yeah, I'm yes. happy about my jacket and I also brought my, my buff, like ah, it's this, this yes. thing you, yes, yes, you yes, yes, yes. Put over. pull over, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I was like zipping up yeah. and when he was taking pictures you could see me like trying to zip it up a bit more. Yes, we are lucky or we were really lucky. Yes, we definitely. Like it, it's gone back cloudy yeah. again. Going down is so much easier, but I feel it on the knees. I won't lie. Monica, yeah, heel, heel toe, heel and toe, heel and toe. We worked up quite an appetite flying through the clouds, so we stopped at this very popular place called Panchocha. Maria told us people are always talking about it and now we all found out why. It's a delicious baked pastry that's huge and filled with a filling of your choice. We chose chocolate. We were there early in the afternoon, but on our drive back from our adventures, the place was packed. Also, if you know anyone who knows Spanish, ask them what Panchocha directly translates to. You'll be surprised. next week's episode we continue the adventures as we leave paragliding to go further out and check out a town on the outskirts of the city called san pablo and all the charming things that it has to offer <music> <laughs>